All right, here we're going to do uh, look at two last examples of multiplying whole numbers, and I'll probably uh, do this in two separate examples. Uh, so in part A here, we've got 6,325 times 124. Um, so 6, 3, 2, 5 times 1, 2, 4. And what I'm going to do is just the same process that we've seen. So let me uh, get another little piece of paper here. So I'm going to pretend like there's only, again, a single digit at a time. So I'm going to cover up the, the 1 and the 2, and I'm just going to multiply. So let's see, 4 times 5 is 20. We keep the 0 and carry the 2. Uh, 4 times 2 is 8, plus 2 is going to be 10, so I'm going to keep the, the 0 and carry the 1. Um, 4 times 3 is 12, plus 1 is going to be 13, I'm going to keep the 3 and carry the 1. And then 4 times 6 is 24, plus 1 is going to be 25. So now done with kind of my first, uh, my first step. So now I'm going to move to the next digit. So I'm going to pretend like the 4 isn't there. And I'm also going to pretend like the 1 isn't there. And I'm just going to do the multiplication. So since I'm, I've moved one digit over, I'm going to put one zero there. And now I'm just going to start doing the multiplication. So again, let me, let me cover up these numbers because... I don't want to accidentally use them again. All right, so I think we're, I think I'm ready here. Let's do our multiplication. So it says two times five is ten. So I'm going to keep the zero and carry a one this time. So let's see, two times two is four plus one is five. Two times three is six, and two times six is 12. All right, so I'm going to get rid of my digit that I carried just so I don't accidentally use it again. And again, the same thing. I'm just going to move to the next digit. Well, that means we can now kind of forget about the 2 and the 4. So I've moved over uh, 1, 2 digits. I'm going to add 1, 2 zeros. Okay. So let's see, we now do 1 times 5. Well, this is easy. Uh, 1 times 5 is 5. 1 times 2 is 2. 1 times 3 is 3. 1 times 6 is 6. I've now multiplied by every digit. Now we just add all of these numbers together. Okay. So 0 plus 0 plus 0, hey, that's 0. 0 plus 0 plus 0, hey, that's 0. Um, we've got, let's see, 5 and 5 is 10. Plus 3 is 13. So I'm going to keep the 3 and carry a 1 here. So 1 plus 5 is 6, plus 6 is 12, 12 plus 2 is 14. I'm going to carry a 1 to the next column. 1 plus 2 is 3, plus 2 is 5, plus 3 is 8, 1 plus 6 is 7. So it says if we multiply uh, 6,325 by 124, we'll get 784,000 and 300.